So we have a new AI video generator in the market that's going to create amazing cinematic movie scenes for you that will look so much realistic that I bet you haven't seen before. So this AI tool is known as Minimax, which is a Chinese AI video generator. And the best thing about it is that you can use that for absolutely free. So yeah, without further ado, let's jump right into the video. Alright guys, so here I am in the homepage of Minimax.ai. So yes, yeah, straight away, it will be named as HaloAI.com slash video. And this is basically the kind of interface. It's a very simple interface. We don't have to put any parameters, any additional settings in order to get started. So first of all, uh, you will see straight away that this is a Chinese AI tool. So the whole interface will be in Chinese language, but don't worry. Uh, you can go ahead and simply click on this translate page and click on English. And with that, it's going to go ahead and translate our whole page, like whole tool into English language so that it's easy for you to use it right now. Okay. So yeah, you guys can see on the page, we have some featured videos that the community have made and take a look at these videos, right? So over here, we have 19th century man packing his bags. So you guys can see this video looks really, really good. We have a very consistent character, very natural moments. It looks really, really realistic, right? So the specific quality about this tool is that it can go ahead and create movie scenes like cinematic scenes with amazing camera motions that you don't see with any other AI tool, right? Like with the help of this tool, you can go ahead and create amazing movie type scenes like, you know, that will look very, very realistic. We don't see any deformation. Like take a look at this footage, right? The zombie is coming uh, into a fish eye camera and wow, this video looks like it's kind of a some movie scene. It doesn't look like AI generated at all. And if I was some kind of a beginner, I would be easily fooled by this kind of video, right? This looked like a very realistic movie scene, right? And if you take a look at this video, so this is a video in which camera switches to a blue and white uh, porcelain vase with a pottery flower painting on it. And take a look at this, right? It looks absolutely perfect, right? So yeah, uh, now we're gonna go ahead and get started with this AI generated. So this is basically the prompt box. In that, you have to basically input your prompt and simply click on generate video. So for creating prompts, I'm going to go ahead and go to chat GPT and type in my simple prompt, like create me prompts for text to video duration. Make sure the prompts are types of movie scenes like cinematic, uh, you know, can be intense, etc. So yeah, chat GPT is going to provide me with different prompts that will relate very, very accurately to our movie scenes, right? So now I'm going to go ahead and simply choose one of the prompt and go to my minimax.ai and simply write over here that a soldier comforting his injured friend, explosions in the background, quiet but intense, right? So we also get one option, which is tip word optimization. So what that basically does, it's going to optimize your prompt words to improve the generation quality, right? So it will work kind of a AI where you will put your simple prompt and that will basically optimize your prompt to generate more and more accurate results, right? So this option is going to help you a lot. So make sure you have turned this on and now I'm going to click on generate video. So for now, this tool is absolutely free. You can go ahead and use that without any paid subscription or anything. But we do have one downside. You need to go ahead and wait in queue, right? So for every generation, you have to wait like three to four minutes in order for video to be completed. So right now, uh, you know, our video is generated by one person. There was queue, but we are on to that. So it will take now around a minute to generate your output, okay? So here is the video, you guys. Wow, this looks absolutely perfect. Like, take a look at the background, right? We have explosion and a soldier is converting his injured friend. And this doesn't look like AI generated video at all, you guys. This looks absolutely perfect, right? Like, take a look at the hands movement. The soldier is moving in the background. We have explosion. The camera is jittering just a little bit. Seems exactly like some kind of a movie scene, right? Like this is absolutely insane. Like how far we have gone into AI video generation now, you guys, right? So then I'm going to input my next prompt, which will be a detective interrogating a suspect cold room, harsh overhead light, intense eye contact, right? So for this AI video generator, you don't have to follow some kind of a prompt formula. You can be as much creative as you want. You can add your like tag words or anything. Just simply click on tip word optimization and it's going to generate a very, very accurate prompts for you, right? So for this prompt, we basically got this result. So this is a detective interrogating a suspect 
and take a look at this right you guys it looks absolutely perfect like you know very very realistic to the mark the camera movement is insane everything looks top notch and we don't see any deformation at all in the face the face looks very natural very realistic and yeah this looks really really accurate you guys right so this is a third video where is a couple standing in the rain shouting at each other and take a look at the rain droplets you know the rain happening in the background uh we have like our vet characters very very accurate in that it looks very realistic there is a very little deformation in the hand sometimes you know this ai tool messes up a little bit but you know no swear deformation or anything like that and yeah you can see the results turn out really really great right so for the next outputs i'm gonna go ahead and add some camera moments as well right so for that you need to go to ChatGPT again and simply type in the prompt like following up now add some camera moments like camera panning or zoom effect etc etc and then now it's going to create more prompts for you with camera moments inside that right like take a look at this video so this is two lovers sharing a quiet moment on a rooftop under the stars camera slowly panning around them and wow this looks really really great you guys right we have very accurate very subtle camera moment no severe deformation whatsoever and the results turn out really really great for that right so similarly we have this prompt a teacher scolding a student in the classroom so right now i basically provided camera shifting between close-up of their faces but somehow it failed to get that camera moment that was looking for but yeah if you go ahead and try that again and again you will somehow get accurate results but for now uh the output looks very very realistic you guys right like that was the main thing and you know, it managed that very perfectly so this is another prompt so we have two rival gang members confronting each other in a narrow alley and you guys can see it looks very very realistic like the moments of the characters in the video it looks up to the mark very perfect we don't have any deformation in the videos you guys right and similarly this is a boxer preparing for a match wrapping his hands in the locker room breathing deeply as the sound of the cheering crowd echoes faintly right so yeah you guys can see it looks very very realistic like you know you can see the lighting on the boxer face right it looks very natural so this is the main highlight of this tool like it can go ahead and create very very realistic results for you guys that will look absolutely insane okay so similarly i went ahead and tried that on you know some kind of a crowd or multiple faces like whether it will maintain that consistency with like loss of characters so the answer is um a little bit so you guys can see this is a prompt a spy secretly passing a briefcase in a crowded train station overhead camera tracking the exchange so you guys can see as it is moving the camera towards the audience so yeah we have a little bit of a deformation on the faces of all the audience and doesn't look that good so let's just say if you are working with this ai tool with like one subject or you know a couple of characters so it will handle that very very accurately but let's just say if you are following a lots of people in that so then we will have a little bit of problem in the output for that right so similarly uh, you can also go ahead and create kind of a vfx effects in the videos as well like you know you guys can see we have an eruption explosion like fire and a very destructive explosion in the video and you know it managed that very very accurately the fire looks really great and you know everything turned out absolutely great you guys right and similarly take a look at this video this is a dark fantasy world full of magic and magical creatures and take a look at this vfx you know it looks really really good so similarly you can go ahead and work with this ai tool to the best possible ways like you know there are a lots of ways you can go ahead and get help with this ai tool so since this ai tool is right now in its very early access so yeah by time to time it's gonna go ahead and get better and better so yeah we will go ahead and test that out in our future videos as well so yeah so that's it for today you guys i hope you liked this video and i'll see you in the next one until then take care bye bye